Now to that Wisconsin college student under arrest this morning facing multiple sexual assault charges and new accusations as police revealed details from his notebooks. ABC's Lindsay Davis is here with the story. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning to you, George. One by one, more women are coming forward. Several say Cook raped them. But Cook's attorneys are calling this a modern-day character assassination. This morning, the University of Wisconsin is caught in a sex scandal firestorm as one of its students faces a string of sexual assault charges. I've seen him around campus a lot. I just hope that he gets brought to justice. Now suspended from campus, 20-year-old Alec Cook was arrested last week after a fellow student claimed he raped her for more than two hours at his Madison apartment earlier this month. Those charges have opened the floodgates to new claims by four other women who also accuse Cook of sexually assaulting them. Now dozens of women are coming forward to police about their alleged encounters with the real estate and urban land economics major. It's scary. He lived a few floors from me. Investigators say they discovered a black leather notebook inside a nightstand drawer in his apartment. On its pages, disturbing details of the women he'd allegedly met and what he wanted to do to them. In this photo, we see a checklist including what makes her special, color of eyes, and even this box labeled killed. But Cook's attorneys are firing back, insisting any encounters were consensual and say the nature of Cook's journal entries was plain innocent. Um, there was no woman named. There was no de description of violent fantasy. There was nothing of that nature. Cook is now behind bars. His bail is set at $200,000. He has yet to enter a plea to the more than a dozen felony counts against him. His next court date is set for November.